In his initial season at Liverpool, Darwin Nunez faced a barrage of insults and criticism for his lacklustre performance, struggling to adapt to the Premier League's formidable defensive style dominated by top-tier defenders. However, Nunez is now ascending, showcasing ferocity that's catalyzing the Reds' ascent as one of the most prolific clubs this season. The Uruguayan striker stands as the linchpin of Liverpool's attacking force alongside Mohamed Salah and Luis Diaz. Smile Football attempts to encapsulate Darwin Nunez's brilliance in the following lines. Initially relegated to the bench earlier in the campaign, the Uruguayan forward grappled with Jurgen Klopp's lack of confidence. Nunez found himself starting only as a substitute in Liverpool's first three Premier League fixtures, earning a starting spot in the fourth week against Aston Villa. Even then, he ranked fifth in Klopp's hierarchy of strikers, with preferences leaning toward Diogo Jota or Cody Gakpo as the Reds' front line. This predicament left the Artigas-born striker discontented at being sidelined from the starting eleven. Klopp justified benching the striker to fortify the team's stability, despite Nunez's pivotal role as Liverpool's saviour in the face of Newcastle United. His brace engineered Liverpool's comeback against Newcastle, prompting Sky Sports pundit Gary Neville to hail Nunez's reliability, attributing dangerous explosive prowess to the player's frontline presence. Nunez continued his scoring spree in Week 6 against West Ham United, breaking through the Hammers' defence in the 60th minute. Klopp lauded the striker's recent improvement, marvelling at Nunez's sharpening edge and escalating prowess in pressing opponents. Alexis McAllister also lauded the striker's increasingly impressive displays, joined by accolades from Arsenal legend Jerry Henry, who prophesied Nunez's potential as a formidable threat for Liverpool. According to this CBS Sport pundit, the striker only requires confidence to unveil his true sharpness. Darwin Nunez's dynamic displays had injected vitality into Liverpool's front line, allowing Jurgen Klopp to craft an optimal attacking setup. Nunez's influence sparked a resurgence in the sharpness of Mohamed Salah, whose brilliance waned last season. The Egyptian striker managed a mere 12 goals in the initial 12 games of the previous season, but this term, Salah has roared back to life tallying 12 goals and 4 assists. Nunez, in turn, has contributed 5 assists to complement Salah's performance, setting up goals for the former AS Roma winger against Aston Villa, LASK, Brighton, and Everton. This lethal duo stands as the season's most formidable partnership, having combined for 19 chances. Their synchronicity continued to impress during Liverpool's clash against Brentford at Anfield Stadium. While Salah showcased his prowess with two goals against the Bees, Nunez resumed his role as the provider, assisting one of Salah's goals. Klopp hailed the Uruguayan striker's substantial impact, highlighting Nunez's enhanced understanding and adaptation to Salah's style of play, enabling a more harmonious partnership compared to the previous season. However, not everyone shares this sentiment. Former Liverpool player Jose Enrique holds a contrasting view, deeming Nunez and Mohamed Salah incompatible as an attacking duo. Enrique argues that Nunez's playing style disrupts Salah's sharpness, citing the Uruguayans' active movements into the penalty area, thereby crowding the space for Salah's goal-scoring opportunities. Enrique suggested deploying Mohamed Salah as a central striker, believing it would heighten his effectiveness over Nunez. Yet, Klopp, known as the normal one, staunchly rebuffed Enrique's proposal, expressing faith in the duo's ability to revitalize Liverpool's attacking prowess. Darwin Nunez's resurgence wasn't limited to club football, it extended to his performances with the Uruguay national team. Despite facing significant criticism during the 2022 World Cup, where Nunez struggled to find the net, enduring comments from former Crystal Palace defender Damian Delaney, who deemed him unfit for the striker's role, Nunez's fortune shifted under Marcelo Bielsa's guidance. The 24-year-old showcased a remarkable turnaround, netting three goals in the latest World Cup qualifiers. His resurgence commenced in a dramatic showdown against Colombia, where the former Benfica player emerged as Uruguay's saviour, slotting a crucial goal in the final minute to secure a 2-2 draw. Nunez's wizardry persisted as he orchestrated a stunning upset against Brazil, 
bagging two goals to secure a 2-0 victory, one goal, and an assist cementing his pivotal role. Marcelo Bielsa lauded Nunez's impressive displays, expressing delight at witnessing the striker's sharpness and urging him to maintain consistency over the long haul. Bielsa's encouraging words acted as a catalyst, reigniting Nunez's spirit. The Uruguayan attacker's brilliance continued to shine brightly in a decisive clash against Argentina, where he contributed a goal just three minutes before the final whistle, propelling Uruguay to a 2-0 victory. This crucial goal shattered Argentina's formidable unbeaten streak of 14 games since the World Cup, a testament to Nunez's impactful resurgence on the international stage. Darwin Nunez's remarkable displays have shifted sentiments, garnering newfound respect, particularly from Liverpool fans who've begun embracing the player. This change was evident during Week 12 when Liverpool triumphed 3-0 over Brentford, culminating in warm applause directed at Nunez from the stands. This gesture signifies the Red supporters placing complete trust in Nunez, despite occasional errors this season, notably a missed opportunity against Luton Town when Liverpool urgently sought a winning goal. Nunez's goal-scoring prowess rarely follows conventional routes, often relying on cut-inside manoeuvres and long-range strikes. Out of his seven goals, the stem from precise incursions into the penalty area, showcasing his adeptness in scoring. Moreover, Jurgen Klopp's growing admiration for Nunez underscores the player's evolution from the previous season. Klopp marvels at Nunez's knack for delivering breathtaking goals, signalling an improved rapport between the coach and the player, considering Nunez's dissatisfaction from frequent bench time last season. As for consistency, Nunez's performance trajectory displays promising signs, but sustaining this level across Liverpool and Uruguay remains an intriguing prospect. Nunez's ability to adapt and continue delivering pivotal performances could solidify his position and transform him into a reliable asset for both club and country.